Now on to new details on the Barnett fire. No official cause determined yet, but neighbors in that area where several homes burned down tell News 5 tonight they saw what started it. Yeah, they say a single spark from a transformer lighting up the grass, the wind then carrying flames to homes nearby. Investigators though still looking into that, but still five homes destroyed. News 5's Katie Blaze spent the afternoon talking with some of those who lost everything. She's in our Pueblo studio. Katie. Yeah, Robin Elizabeth, definitely an emotional and very difficult time for those affected by this fire. The video shows you just how destructive this fire was, leaving these people with literally nothing but the clothes on their back. Honestly, I've, I've been in a daze since yesterday. It's just mind numbing. It's hard to believe that only a day ago, Steve Little's mobile home stood in this spot. I wasn't able to salvage anything, total loss. A fire ripping through his neighborhood on Barnett Road, destroying his home and four others. This was my music room where I had my guitars, uh, my amp, had an oldie but goodie 83 Honda Magna. Some of that stuff is just you can't replace it, you know, so it's heartbreaking. For Little, the most heartbreaking loss of all, his 18-year-old cat, Tiger. He was a tiger-striped tabby. He was an older cat, but he was just an adorable sweetheart. I couldn't get in to get him out. All the pictures of his cat lost in the rubble as well. He's working through this tragedy as best he can, neighbor Barb Benedict doing the same. You expect to come down and you see the blue house and you and all of a sudden you don't. This was my master bedroom right here. You generally can't see through from one end to the other, but uh, yeah, that's my that's what's left of my headboard. This was my utility room and my nice washer and dryer. Benedict's home and everything inside it may be gone, but what the fire hasn't taken away, her unyielding spirit. I'm sad, of course, but uh, We'll rise again. We rise. That's what we do here. Okay. We'll be okay. Well, thankfully, both Little and Benedict have insurance. They tell me they will rebuild on Barnett Road. In the meantime, the community really coming together to help victims like them. The Red Cross is also helping out. If you lost your home in this fire and need lodging or anything else during this time, here is the number to call. 800-417-0495. Always watching out for you, Pueblo. Katie Blaze, News 5.